This is usually a gaming channel, but today we'll be doing something a little different. I got a new shirt just for the occasion. Yeah. Today, we'll be drawing crap. White crap? Who knows? First thing I think I'm gonna draw is a mountain. Basically, that's it. Maybe some rivers. I don't know. Make sure your pens, when you're doing, well, here's a little tip. When you're drawing, make sure when you're drawing light strokes, put your hand further back. Don't press too hard. And this will create a lighter uh, shade. If you want a darker shade, put it as close as you can want to. Adjust your hand. It'll make a... And press a little harder, it'll make a darker shade. No, not too much of a triangle. We're gonna make a bunch of tiny triangles into a big triangle. That doesn't make sense, but it will. Just trust me. First things first. All right, so we drew three triangles into this. Now this may not seem that incredible, but it's gonna look better, trust me. So, for this next uh, part, we want the your hand to be pretty close to the eraser, where the eraser would be on the pencil. Just, and where this line is, start shading in, like so. Now put your pencil a little closer to the tip and make a hard, a hard stroke. So it shows that, that this is a mountain and this is a shadow of the mountain. Now, what we're gonna do next is draw a line all the way up the mountain. And draw two lines where the mountain was, where across the, the first triangle, basically. Let's see what we're gonna do next. Is erase some of this. This is where the Yeah, that's a thing. Now, now that we got this, we need to do this draw another line right there. Etc. Then do the exact same thing. Draw sh shades where the sun would be. Darken one side of the triangle and not the other. Basically. We have two shaded triangles. Now we have to do the last one and then we'll go into some fine art. Make this thing a lot better than it already is. Now we shade some more. And there we go, there's a mountain. Now, I could stop there, but this video has to have some clickbait. So what we're going to do next is I'm going to draw the Fortnite monster, you know, from that one event. All right, let's do this. All righty, so first thing we need to do is draw the head. His head has, so in order to make his head, we need to erase 
we need to draw just a tiny circle. I'm not a tiny circle, a big circle, but very lightly. We don't want the people to see the circle. Just like that. That's where the head is going to be. So I erase everything that's in that circle. Like so. I need a better eraser. That's better. Okay, we got the circle and stuff. Now let's start with, and this monster is gonna be hard to draw. Good grief, we should practice first. <laughs> let's start with the eye. So this eye is going to be the easiest part of the whole thing. Just. Just like that. We're not gonna color it. So, yeah. If you do want to color it, you can. Like so. You can color it with a marker if you need to, but I'm not gonna use a marker because reasons. So, with that out of the way. He does not have a nose, but he has this weird marking on the uh, his eyeballs. So let's go ahead and get that out of the way. So he has this triangle right here. A triangle right here. Shade that in, I guess. All right, so I had to grab a new pencil, which is just a colored pencil, but I'm not gonna use it for the pencil part. I'm using it for the eraser. So, now that we drew the eyes, we're going to draw the head piece. He has these lines on the side of his eyeballs. You probably can't see it, but it's... That's better. You got that out of the way. Can you even see that? You can see it. Then draw... Two lines, one right there, right there. Actually draw four lines, two right there, a U, and etc. These are gonna be the horns. Then draw like a U shape right there. You can do some little adjustments right here if you want. There we go. Now, we're gonna draw his upper lip. Now draw a line. Right, so. It doesn't have to be perfect, he's not perfect. He's not the brightest pickle in the barrel. I don't know if I'm using that saying correctly, but hey, you know. You have to draw teeth. This part's gonna be the hard part, trust me. So we're gonna draw some jagged, some jagged teeth. Draw another lip right there. go we got some teeth go. now draw a big tooth like so using the other lines as a as a guide raise some of it fix the tooth because he has some pretty big teeth here Got that out of the way. He has a pretty big mouth, so yeah. Draw some triangles. 
some more jagged stuff. He is a carnivore through and through. That looks about right for the teeth. Now, he has a weird cheekbone. I mean, he has a weird chin. He doesn't have weird cheekbones. He, he has a square-shaped chin with pointy parts coming out of it. So, let's do that. Oh crap. Oh, never mind, let me fix it. Let me do this. Now. We've got the monster. We're not quite finished yet though. We've got the monster's face, and that's important, but what about the arms, right? He has big shoulders. I'm pretty sure this and this are shoulders, and this right here is just regular mountain. Like that. Now let's do some shading, y'all. The mountain can't be the only thing with shading. So, let's do stuff. So he has these weird swirly parts all over him, like scales, but not. I don't know how to explain it, but he's got these weird markings. That's good, that's good. So. Let's get these markings out of the way. We don't have to make them look perfect. Like I've been saying the whole video. But, yeah, those are his markings for his shoulders. He's got some, I'm pretty sure it's battle damage. Yeah. And that will be his lip. <laughs> Could do. It's this. There's the monster, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, leave a like. Comment down below. Subscribe. Make sure you keep on your notifications. And until next time, peace out. Ciao.